What's good, YouTube? Because of Kobe here. So, we are diving into a request from Dedry. This is John Williamson, you and my guitar. Very excited to dive into another new artist on the channel. You guys have been recommending some amazing music in the last two weeks. I am blown away by the music that we have gotten into on here, the topics we've discussed. The lyricism has been top tier. We have gotten into some amazing topics, so I appreciate all of the requests. It's amazing to get on here, break all this down with you guys, and get to know each other better, and it's a blessing, man. It really is a blessing, so thank you so much for all the requests. If you're new here, subscribe for me. We talk about mental health, addiction, world issues, everything in between. Break down all the lyrics, the instrumentations. It's a great time, positive vibes, everybody here very supportive of each other we built an amazing community that supports people who are feeling alone or in need of somebody to talk to whether they're going through mental health or addiction or just feeling alone we will be here for you in this community everybody here is very supportive of each other and that's my favorite thing about the way that we are on here it's, it truly is a blessing so we're going to get into this um because of coffee reaction video a day or two Keep the doctor away. Fuck those apples. This is John Williamson, you and my guitar, requested by Dedry. Hey, okay. This guitar only sings the way I play it. It's yeah. part of me just like another arm. Oh, I love it. It started out as a little ukulele. When I was just a boy on the farm, my fingers were too lazy for. I was not sure what style to expect whenever we got into this, and it's amazing. It's folk mixed with that classic country vibe to it as well. I love it. This is a classic vibe right here, and the, the lyricism, man, the lyricism as if the guitar is just a extension of yourself right that is a beautiful beautiful metaphor when i was just a boy on the farm my fingers were too lazy for piano but i could hold a tune pretty good and i couldn't sing a song with a trombone so i taught myself to play this piece of wood there you go and you taught yourself how to sing too, apparently. That sounds good. His voice is very nice. Very, very solid voice. Classic voice right here. He's got that classic country voice going on. This is what you hear playing on the radio, playing GTA 5, listening to the fucking Rebel Radio Station, right? You gotta fucking love it. <laughs> this guitar only sings the way I play it. It's part of me just like another arm started out as a little ukulele when I was just a boy on the farm. He said, I started playing this when I was still too small to hold a big one. <laughs> My fingers were too lazy for piano. Piano's crazy, man. Playing piano, it's a wild time if you get into the complex pieces. There are so many weird stretches and shit that your fingers do when playing piano that you gotta exercise, man. You gotta like extend your fingers, right? <laughs> extend those muscles because piano, there's a lot of direction going on and their guitar gets smaller the higher up you go on the octaves on your strings, the smaller it gets. So it gets easier to do fast stuff. And that's the advantage of guitar for people with smaller hands, right? People with smaller hands will definitely play guitar easier. Well, fingers, I should say specifically, more so fingers are what's more important than the whole hand. Finger length is what's more important. Man, he said, my fingers were too lazy for piano, but I could hold a tune pretty good. I couldn't sing a song with a trombone, so I taught myself to play this piece of wood. Beautiful right there. That is so poetic. Like I said, we've had some great lyricism on here these last couple weeks. This is a beautiful storytelling of coming in to playing an instrument and why it was selected. All of that beautiful right here. I know you are staying beside me. True lovers, we both feel the pain. And I'd throw this old box on the fire before I'd ever lose you again. Hey. Will you never 
but I know you are staying beside me. True lovers, we both feel the pain. And I throw this old box on the fire before I never lose you again. Ooh. Ooh. Wow. Wow. This is about love as well. This chorus tied it into love, saying I would rather throw this old box on a fire than lose my love again. Right? And apparently, if this is in a true manner, if this is a true story inside of his life, they did not want the box on the fire. Right? If they were still together, the box did not end up going on the fire. But he said I would. If it means never losing you again, right? That's fucking beautiful right there. That's beautiful songwriting. I like it. I did like this old guitar, did you, darling? Because the guitar takes your man away from you. <laughs> One day I'll write a song for you, darling. Yes. That'll be the very best that I can do. He made the decision. See, there it was. He made the call in this song. Yep. Yep, yep. Know the feeling. He said, well, you never did like this old guitar, did you, darling? Because the guitar takes your man away from you. One day I'll write a song for you, darling. That'll be the very best that I can do. <sighs> man, oh man, this is classic right here. This is a story that so many people have, so many artists have, of all genres, all walks of life, coming from all directions. This is a classic story of an artist right here and he is telling it very beautifully i love songs like this this is just that classic i've stuck to my dreams and this is what i went through in the process of losing that and i'm gonna tell you now here i am and i wrote this right i one day i'll write a song for you that'll be the very best that i can do because i ain't gonna put this guitar down he made a call he said, uh, you know what? No, it's not going near the fire. I'm not putting this down. Darling, that'll be the very best that I can do. Will it be a song about a wild wind with a thunderclap and flashes of blue? Or will it be a song about an angel? It'll never be as beautiful as you. Will it be a song about a wild wind? With a thunderclap and flashes of blue. Beautiful storytelling and descriptor right there. Will it be a song about an angel? It'll never be as beautiful as you. Man. <clears throat> He's saying, I walked away, but you're still damn beautiful, though. He said, <laughs> my man. He says, damn, I can't even say that it's. It's like that. He says, you're still beautiful, man. I still think it's beautiful, but I had that. I could not. Right? He's saying I could not for the life. <laughs> it's like that sometimes in life, man. And he's telling this story very beautifully and respectfully as well. I like it. It's very, very respectfully written. It's written in a very modest tone with beautiful, gorgeous descriptors. I like his approach to this story. I know you. It's picking with all those individual notes very quickly. So it's like a strum, but the pick, the notes are being picked inside of the strum. That's almost the motion of the technique that you use to do that. It's a very cool technique, almost similar to sweep picking almost, is sort of what he's doing, but it's more of a strum added in there. It's a very cool effect that they just did in that guitar section right there. It's a very... It's actually a difficult technique to pull off and to play smoothly over and over again without fucking up. It's a very, very cool technique. I like that right there. By staying beside me, true lovers, we both feel the pain. And I throw this old box on the fire before I'd ever lose you again. This guitar only sings the way I play it yeah. It's a part of me just like another run It started out as a little ukulele When 
I was just a boy on the farm But now I am a man with a woman The words I want to say won't come true No matter where this guitar's gonna take us It'll never be as beautiful as you are oh, yay. yay, you'll see how that ended the resolution inside of here I love songs that have a very de definitive resolution like this. Man, I really fuck with this right here. John Williamson is awesome. Dedry, thank you for this request. This is really cool right here. I love the lyricism. I'm just going over these again. Refreshing on the top of the song. I love this. The storytelling in this is gorgeous. He ends it with the repeat of the chorus, right? He says, but I know you're staying beside me, true lovers. We both feel the pain. I throw this old box on the fire before I never lose you again. This guitar only sings the way I play it. It's part of me, just like another arm. It started out as a little ukulele when I was just a boy on the farm. But now I am a man with a woman. The words I want to say won't come through. No matter where this guitar is going to take us, it'll never be as beautiful as you. I love it. I'll oh, fuck with this heavy. This is a nice song right here. He gets, he ends up with a woman at the end. He says, no matter where this guitar takes both of us, he says, it'll still never be as beautiful as you. I love it. I fucking love it, man. This is awesome. I'm going to like on this video right here. Fucking dope right here. Let's finish this out. Subscribe to John Williamson. Support all the artists we have on the channel. That's what we do this for. Get this music out into the world. Discuss the topics in it. Relate it to our own life. This is a relatable story about an artist struggling with love and deciding over guitar or the girl. And at the end of the day, it ends up with both of them. And he says, no matter where this ends up taking us, it'll still never be as beautiful as you. The compromise and resolution at the end. Beautiful writing here. Beautiful storytelling. John Williamson, amazing song right here. The original video will be in the description. Like I said, subscribe to all the artists we have on the channel. Make sure you support them. It's very important to get art out into the world and discuss these topics and relate them to our own lives. Have a community for each other where we can stand together and make sure that nobody feels alone, especially inside of issues like mental health and addiction because that's a place where a lot of people feel very alone. It's easy to feel very alone when you're going through those things. So to have a place for all of us where we can safely discuss those things and be here for each other means the whole world to me. It's been a goal for a long, long time, a long period of my life. And to see it actually finally starting to become a thing is incredible. And to have all of you being the ones supporting it, I couldn't ask for better people. You really hold it down. You're here for each other. You're here for everybody that shows up and needs help. You send me in the direction of people that leave comments that need help and make sure that I see them. You guys really look out for everything. It means the fucking world to me. Thank you so much for this. We're going to get out of here. I'm Bacasa Kavi. A reaction video a day or two. Keep the doctor away. Fuck those apples. Leave a like for me. Comment those suggestions. Subscribe up this way. Bang that notification bell for me. I'll see you guys in the next one. I love you so much. Have a beautiful one. Thanks for everything. Peace.